Again, trying to do it all on his own and did it well. Robertson floating it. Farmer. Oh, oh still Farmer. <laughs> still he goes and then into the pocket. Stephen Powell was just trying to push off and play on. Uze floating down to the squares now, manned up by a heat black. Hey, Neil Danaher, don't take Jeffrey Farmer off the ground because he's one of the reasons that he's going to keep this game alive. <laughs> he is just an excitement machine. Well, Melbourne must really be considered as a genuine threat in the finals. My word, I saw them play against Essendon and they got within two goals of the Bombers. And one of the reasons is they've got a lot of players that can kick goals. Stephen Powell is one of those players. And he had a good year, Stephen Powell, My since word. Uh, crossing from the Western Bulldogs. His kicked, ability to run hard or... Kicked 18 goals before today. 18, Hutto, has he? No, his ability to run all day. Here we are, City Farmer spin around Sean McManus. Threw the ball out, showed the dummy, and just brilliant foot schools had a fine Steve, Stephen Powell. As I said, he's been one of those brilliant midfielders with a Woden Lee and Chelly and Regan. He's had great years. Melbourne will be a better side because he can play Travis Johnston. Out wide Lee on Chelly. Another goal coming up. Stephen Powell, he's second for the quarter, and he got bang and he kicks a goal. Very much a drill there for Melbourne. And again, they got a goal from right in front through Powell. It is amazing, uh, Robo and Hutto, here we see the Demons turn the ball over twice with shock and handballs. I mean, I think one was the Travis Johnson one, and I think one went to the centre of the ground, I'm not sure who it was. But they still had the ability to find a teammate on their own in Stephen Powell.